Hi Maxine and or Paul. My name is Parker and I work for YEG SEO. We are a marketing agency here in the Edmonton area. And after speaking with Maxine on the phone yesterday, I thought I'd shoot you guys over this quick video going over three things that you can do today to start beating out your competition online. Now, I don't want to waste any of your time and I don't want to waste mine either. So if by the end of this, if you would like to know more on how we can grow your business online, then give me a call and I'd love to have a chat. If not, then no harm, no foul. You can take these tips today and try and put them into action for your business. Now, let's get right into it here. The three things I'm going to be going over are content, citations, and backlinks. And the first thing is going to be content. And that's basically anything you can see on the front page, including your pictures, what the pictures are saved as, and also what's behind the pictures. Those are all included as content. So, for example, if I go and try and save a photo here on your home page, you can see it's just saved as MM Electrical Home. And I bring that up because you can actually save every single individual image on your whole website as different keywords and phrases. And that will help you guys out because those keywords and phrases are constantly being searched for by people on Google when they are looking for your types of services. So that's one part of content. The other part would be the words itself on your home page here. And we like to have at least 1,500 words on a home page alone because that really helps with getting optimized by Google. And it helps so that the more content you have, the more of a chance you have to throw in all of those keywords and phrases that I am talking about. So as I continue to scroll here, your website does look really good already. However, I definitely would add some more content and make sure you're getting the number of keywords and phrases you have up as high as you can. So the second thing I'm going to go over are citations. And you can see here, all I did was search for is Sherd Park Electrical Services there. And quickly before citations, to go over these ads here first, um, these Google guaranteed ads, those companies actually had to go through a verification process through Google to get them guaranteed with the green check mark. And I bring that up just because if you guys were ever interested in doing advertisements, I would definitely recommend going through that same process as well because these guaranteed ads seem to get way better traffic than those traditional advertisements you see down here on Google. Now that's it for advertisements. If I go to citations now, like I was saying, those would take place more down in the map section of Google here. And all a citation is, is a business's name, address, and phone number listed into different directories throughout the internet. And if you guys are wondering what a directory is or how can you get put into one, well, to simply put it, all a directory is, is a website out there allowing businesses to enter their business information and services. So a few examples of directories would be Yelp or Yellow Pages or LinkedIn or even Facebook has a directory for citations. And all that's going to do for you guys is give you another avenue for people to reach and find your website. So a good technique that we like to use is to actually go and see the competition you'd have in the area and what directories they're currently using because there's a good chance that if they are working for them already, then they also could be working for you guys. And you don't want to just go out and get what your competition would have for citations and directories. You want to go out and get a lot more. So that way you can outrank them on Google and find yourself on this map section up here. Now. The next thing I'm going to go over are backlinks, and that'll take place more down in the organic part of a Google search down here. And all a backlink is is another website that is linking back to you guys, saying that you offer electrical types of services. That way it just brings more relevance and more keywords that you guys are constantly trying to rank for so people can find you more easily on Google. Now with this tool that we like to use called AREFs, you can see that I can actually look at a website's referring domains and backlinks and traffic that they are bringing in on a monthly basis. So I already have you guys loaded in here and I can see you have 11 referring domains giving you 15 backlinks and 11 organic clicks of traffic every single month. Now if I were to look at one of your competitors in the area, you can see here it's not too much more, but they do have 17 referring domains, giving them 38 backlinks. And you can see they're getting 48 organic clicks of traffic every single month. So it's not too big of a difference, but you can see just based off where you rank on Google, you can actually be getting quite a bit more traffic and business every single month. And the positive about this is that these guys would not be too hard to beat out and rank higher than because they do not have too many more backlinks, referring domains, or keywords on their website, as I see here. 
but I can actually click on the referring domains and I can see every single website that is currently linking back to your competitor, giving them the relevance and authority they do have in the marketplace right now. So like with citations, you actually can go out and look at these websites and try and get them to link back to you guys as well because there's a good chance that they will also work for you. And also, just like citations, you don't want to just go out and get the amount of backlinks or, or sorry, referring domains your competition would have. You want to go out and get a lot more than them. So that way you can try and outrank them on the organic side of Google as well. Because that is the main goal here, is to just completely outrank them on every part of Google so that more people can be seeing your website and you can be bringing in a lot more traffic. So I do really hope that this video has been informative for you guys. Like I said at the beginning, you are free to take these tips and run with them for yourself if you would like. But if not, my information is all right here. And if you would like to discuss further on how our team can help grow your business online, then please give us a call and I'd be very happy to hop on the phone with you guys. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch this video and I wish you the best of luck in your future. Thank you.